The mean value of a data set is a good numerical summary. In fact, this is the uh, this is the average which is most commonly used in summarizing a data set. However, it is possible that the mean can give a misleading impression of a data set if that value is skewed. And let's see an example now to see what this means. Okay, so I have a data set of uh, the earnings of some top entertainers in the year 2007. Okay, so here's my data set. I have 10 entertainers and their earnings rounded off to the nearest million dollars. Okay, so to calculate the mean of this data set, we know what to do. We, need, we simply just add up the data set, we add up those values, we get 648 million. There are 10 entertainers, and so we simply divide that number by 10, and we get the mean value of 64.8 million as a summary of this data set. But if we look back at the data set, we notice that the mean value, the 64.8, is actually greater than all but two of the data values. <clears throat> and that, of course, is because these uh, entertainers at the top, Oprah Winfrey and Steven Spielberg, uh, earn so much more than all of the others. And when this happens in a data set, we refer to the mean as skewed by those values. So one thing we can do is to use a different measure, and that measure is known as the median. To come up with a median, we need to arrange our data set in order, so either the numbers in increasing order or in decreasing order, and then the median value is the value in the middle. Now there are two possibilities. If we have an odd number of values, then there will be only one number in the middle, and that will be defined as the median value. If there are an even number of values, then we have two numbers in the middle, and to get the median, then we need to take the mean of those two values. Okay, so let's look back at our uh, previous data set. And if we're now interested in using the median value as a summary, then we need to find the value in the middle. Well, this data set is already written in order, so that's pretty easy. We just need to count it down from the top and up from the bottom. One, two, three, four, five. So that's 40 there, and then one, two, three, four, five. And we have uh, these two values in the middle, 40 and 33. And so to get the median value,
we just take the average of those two values. 40 plus 33 and divide by 2 and we get 36.5. And 36.5 in a sense uh, gives a better summary of this data set than the mean value which was skewed by those large values there at the top. 